Will Kate Middleton hand out awards at Wimbledon amid cancer treatment? Organisers are optimistic. The Princess of Wales is patron of the All England Tennis and Croquet Club, and club president Debbie Jevons says they will give her as much flexibility as possible. Hello, welcome to Royal Diaries. Before we continue please subscribe to the channel for more British royal family news. Also, like this video and join our community here at Royal Diaries so you don't miss the latest updates. A staple of Kate Middleton's summer calendar is not off the table as she continues her cancer treatment. The Princess of Wales, 42, regularly attends Wimbledon and is known for awarding prizes at the tennis tournament as patron of the All England Tennis and Croquet Club. Although she has remained out of the public eye during her treatment, Wimbledon organisers are hopeful she can continue the tradition at the event this year. Club president Debbie Jevons told Telegraph Sport they would give Princess Kate as much flexibility as possible, with the outlet reporting that a call on who will present the prizes may not be made until the morning of the finals. The Princess of Wales has largely kept a low profile in 2024, recovering from abdominal surgery in January before revealing in March that post-operative tests had found cancer and she was undergoing chemotherapy. She returned to the spotlight for her first public engagement with the royal family since Christmas at Trooping the Colour on June 15. However, palace aides have stressed that King Charles's birthday outing does not signal a return to public life. No date has been set for her full return to royal work. Since her appearance on Trooping the Colour, Princess Kate has skipped events she would normally attend such as Garter Day, Royal Ascot and a state visit to Japan. Prince Harry appeared to stay home as well when Prince William celebrated his birthday on June 21 at Taylor Swift's concert in London with Prince George and Princess Charlotte, where they posed for a selfie with the pop star. Queen Elizabeth served as patron of the All England Lawn Tennis Club from 1952 until 2016, when she passed the baton to her granddaughter-in-law. The avid tennis player and fan has attended a Grand Slam tournament almost every year since her marriage to Prince William in 2011. She even wanted to watch live tennis matches in 2013 while she was very pregnant with son Prince George, but doctors advised against it. Princess Kate has taken to centre court to hand out awards in the years since, including the winners of the women's and men's singles finals in 2023. In the match between Spain's Carlos Alcaraz and Serbia's Novak Djokovic, she sat in the front row of the royal box. With Prince William and the two eldest children, Prince George and Princess Charlotte. The outing marked Princess Charlotte's Wimbledon debut, while Prince George will also attend the event in 2022. Princess Kate said in a personal message released on June 14 that she had started doing some work from home and expressed her hope of joining some public engagements over the summer. Any outings in the coming weeks will depend on how well she feels able and follows medical guidelines. The royal mother of three said in the letter that she was making good progress, but as anyone who has gone through chemotherapy knows, there are good days and bad days. On those bad days, you feel weak and tired and have to give in to your body's rest, but on the good days, when you feel stronger, you want to make the most of feeling good. She's been doing what's right for her and recovering in privacy at home. She's handling it the best she can. A source close to the royal family tells people exclusively in their latest cover story. I'm learning to be patient, Princess Kate herself confirmed in her June 14th health update. Thanks for watching till the end. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and join our community for more updates.